What's good, you, my player? How's it going, everybody? It's your boy, Mans Manino from Now Never Crew, and today we are reacting to B Boy Meno versus Killa Coila 2019 Red Bull BC1 finals. Let's go, it's gonna be hot, baby! Look at that production quality upgrade, though. They got lights in their hallways now. Big step up in 2016, hey? <laughs> Mumbai the hype though. Dude, that's trippy, hey? Kilakula! The man of the people. Go. I feel the stages have like almost gone smaller. Maybe I'm tripping out, but I feel like they were like bigger in the earlier years. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Dude, Meadow's ready. Rocking that brown tracksuit. I think Meadow has a different tracksuit for every day of the month. Or maybe a year. Go. Woo! Shut the gate with them concepts. Hey. Bro, flow for days. Yo, that thread? One more time, one more time on that thread. That thread is sick. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Woo! Dude, that's hard. Woo! He held it the whole way. Like, you know when people have like solid thread or not because they hold it longer than you'd expect them to hold it. Most people let go as soon as they get through. But he held it till all the way to the back. That's nasty. Good boy, Lanky B Boy's rap. Let's go. Woo! Woo! This is the round. The iconic round. Ah! Woo! Do the musicality. Your boy. Crazy. Ah! Oh, it never gets old. Oh my goodness, dude. That's how you rep, like, that's how you rep properly when you're in a certain country. Like, dude, my goodness. One more time. God, so intelligent. This round is just crazy, bro. You can see the conviction on his face. Ah! I love when B-Boys are expressive like that. Like, look at when, when he's breaking his face, bro. He's so in it. Passion, baby. So simply and so effective. Ah, I'm right on the beat, dude. Like, woo! Bro. That's what you call humbly smoking somebody. That's the definition of humbly smoking someone. Yes, Killer Coyle easily took that round. He was in the pocket, as I like to say. Nice. I know it's got moves for days, man. Classic, classic. Yes. Flowing. But yeah, man, he definitely did not take the hype back from uh, Killer Coil he got from the crowd. The crowd's definitely on his side. Let's go, kill him. Hey. Nice. 
Yeah, I can see it. With the... Hey! A little similar than his first one. Nice. I don't know, man. That's a little bit of a hard one. Ooh. I think I would have edged that to kill her, though. He just did more. Neither of them really, like, nailed it for me. But Meadow's entrance there was nasty. Classic baby freeze. Watch. Dude. I can't believe you can UFO out of those. Just like a basic mail like that. Sick. Tell you, man. Meadow generates power from the craziest positions. Woo! Bro, he plays with... Goodness. His concept connections are crazy. Tell you man, Killer Coil is really rocking it all up top a lot more than Meadow is. Have you guys seen those Meadow Talk Rock compilations? They're funny. <laughs> hey. Nice. right now. I think Menno's like edging him on like technicality but dude Killer Coil's on that raw b-boy tip right now and I gotta say like it's more refreshing to me than Menno is right now. Uh, that's kind of a bite bro. <laughs> Dude, that's hard, bro. See what I mean? Killer Crow's on that raw b with tip and he doesn't care. Well, let's keep breaking, baby. When you can go that many rounds in his finals and you can still, like, and you go past, bro, I don't know. To me, that always shows, that always edges it for me on any close battle. I think if I was voting from, like, a well-rounded, signature technicality basis, I would vote metal. But on like a b-boy passion, refreshing like tip, I would vote Killer Coil personally. But yeah man, it's, it's hard, again, hard to judge very different uh, approaches to the dance. But dude, this hit right here, on the pocket baby. Goodness. Like when you see stuff like that, it just makes you so biased to that person in the moment. You're just like, dude, just, he just, he just, he won everyone's hearts right there. Okay. Let's, let's uh, fast track here a little bit. Were they, were they chanting? Yeah, they were chanting Coila. Coila. See, man, he's a peep, person of people, baby. Yeah, see, I can, I can see it. Because again, he pleases the judges more, you know? On like the system's approach to breaking, like. He's playing the judges game more than Coyla is. <laughs> Lil G's like, oh, can we go yet? Yeah, boy, let's go. Cause like, but again, there you know, like Lil G is again more on the on Coyla tip, right? intact see because again intact plays in that same realm that metal does more so you can kind of start to see like by the judges what they're gonna vote for because again like I don't know man, that's crazy. 
So this is hard because this is when you have some of the most controversial battles because you have people that have seen Menno so much because he's, you know, he's out there all the time and he's at the top so much. So, so people get so bored of his style. Um, so it's hard because you have these people that watch it and are viewing it and they're gonna hate the heck out of the judges' choices there and uh, on Menno because they're like, oh, I've seen those moves all the time, all the time, and they don't really get it. But the, the reality is, is Menno was, again, as I said, playing the game better than Kilakoila was in the sense of of not taking as many chances as being cleaner, being more well-rounded, being all these things. But but again, when it comes to like that raw b-boy crowd in the moment-ish, and I wasn't even there, um, then Kilakoila, like, you know, it's, it's obvious to people from that side that like Kilakoila clearly took that. But then you, you know, you just, it depends on what, are you going off of paper? Are you going off of energy, vibe, and mentality? You know what I mean? So. One of those crazy battles, man, that people are gonna talk about. Let me know, comment down below, who do you think won? Like, subscribe, smash the button for more videos, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Love is love. Love is love.